Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Mary Grace and I got my porch goose from Auntie M's Garden Gnome Emporium. Look at him! He's a strawberry! <laughs> You guys, I'm so excited. We are back with more Percy Jackson today. We are watching episode four of season one. After this, we will be halfway through the first season. We are going to St. Louis today. I'm very excited. It's only a 34 minute long episode. That, that is, so much is gonna happen in such a short period of time. I'm not prepared, but I also, I'm so excited. I really like what they're doing so far with the like monsters that we're coming across. Like I keep going back to that for that moment in the first episode, the flashback of Percy and his mom in the museum. And they're like looking at Medusa, right? They're looking at Percy as holding Medusa's head. And Percy's like, well, she's a monster. And Sally is like, not everyone who looks like a monster is a monster and not everyone who looks like a hero is a hero. I keep going back to that moment, like in my head as these things keep unfolding with like Medusa trying to like play to Percy's like weaknesses and be like, hey, I can help you get your mom back. And Electo uh, trying to like play to Annabeth's we weakness being like, hey, I'll help you get glory. I'll help you uh, like succeed and get ahead if you betray your friends and like give Percy up to me like it's so It's so good. I saw someone say um, That it was like their way of introducing their fatal flaws Like so early on in a very subtle way and I really love that and like now I can't help but think about that moment in Sea of Monsters with the sirens and it's just like it just makes me so excited to see what is gonna come after this and just I'm just so excited I can't wait we're gonna get right into it and we are going to watch Percy Jackson and the Olympians season one episode four called I plunge to my death <laughs> Ooh, we're at the pool is this a flashback we have been in the same position for 15 minutes please come on just do it <laughs> once with me can we go home now not the son of the sea god being afraid of water it could be dangerous for you if you don't know how to do this. Yeah. One day it could be really, really important and I may not be there to help you when that happens. So I need to make sure you can do it. Breeze. What? Just breathe, mommy. Oh, this little Percy is so cute. You'll always be here. Oh, my heart. <sighs> Oh no, no, it's nightmare. I don't like it. Hello again, little hero. I don't like it. A forbidden child attracts attention. A forbidden hero, well, they attract doom. She is coming. Oh no. You and Dahlia were really close, right? What was she like? Hmm. Why? Because she was a forbidden child. She was tough. I mean, she knew she was a forbidden kid. She just didn't care. I mean, you really can't. Luke cares for me right away. But Alia. She oh, she it. did it? Hmm. Is that why you give me a hard time? I gotta earn it with you, too? Yeah. Maybe. I gotta say, it doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Oh, having to earn love? The way the gods want us to think. Aww. Gotta burn an offering to get a parent's attention. Gotta beat up on Clarice just to get my father to admit he's my father. Oh. It isn't supposed to work that way. Because Sally just loved him so much for free. Learn from him. I started out as a gift to my father. That's how it works with a thing. <sighs> We're born mm. from a thought in her mind and then given to a partner she feels connected to. And for a while, I was treated like a gift. Oh. Oh, this hurts my heart so much. Oh, my baby girl. Then he met a woman. They had their own kids. And to her, I, I wasn't a gift. That was a problem. 
Oh, I have chills. <laughs> oh, we're getting so deep. It isn't the gods who think that way. It's everybody. Mm. Percy realizing that his mom was the exception. What is that? Oh, what? It, what? What was that? Excuse me. Can I see your tickets, please? He looks familiar. You are in 17B. Yes? Why does he look so familiar? <gasps> Excuse me? What's happening? You want to explain? <gasps> That's the thing that went the. Wait, you think we did this? Did you? I mean, how and why? Literally, how would they do that? We got a witness here says she heard the window smash <gasps> and then heard children's voices. Oh, come on. Are we under arrest? I don't think you want to take that tone with me, little girl. Are we under arrest? Yeah! <laughs> Look at her. I love her. You aren't spending a day answering questions in the St. Louis police station. We need to get out of this before we get delayed. <laughs> do you mind if no. I say it? Yes. Already hate her. Don't children get scared when they're all alone? No. It's okay. I'm a mom. I know how scared you <gasps> must be. Not her being like, I'm a mom. There are some things I need Grover, to Grover, you gotta start understand. sniffing. There's something on your jacket. It looks like... Looks like glass. Grover! <laughs> yes, sweetheart. I know. I know. I don't like that. Oh, but we're almost there. I don't like her sniffing. We've run across a few monsters like you, and we've sent them all packing. Of course, they're like me. They were my children. Mother of monsters. Echidna. Echidna! She's probably the most terrifying, like, from the first book. To my eye, the demigod is a more dangerous creature. <sighs> Disruptive. Violent. Disruptive? That chihuahua out there is disruptive. She's just a pup now. She's terrifying. Today, you will be her prey. Are you afraid yet? I am. I would be. But she's gonna eat off of that. I needed you to understand what was happening so that she could track the scent and grow because well, that's what a good mother- Not her unzipping! You should run now. Run away! The train is still moving! He just got, he full on just got, oh, oh my god, the train is still moving. They're not even stopped in St. Louis yet. I am terrified. <sighs> what are you doing, girl? Oh, Annabeth. Oh, I love your mind, Annabeth. Where is he? Open this door. Come back here, open this door. Uh, what is that? It's a stinger. Gover, do you know what kind of monster has one of those? I don't know, I mean, nothing good, probably. I'm so nervous. The fact that this is happening on the train. We gotta move. <laughs> the train is making an unplanned stop. Yeah, run. I am running. Why is it still chasing us? A kid in said whatever she was hiding in that carrier, it's young. It won't venture too far from my mother. She's learning to hunt. And this seems like the hunting part. Oh my God, that's horrifying. It's so good. This is how you show Athena your love. A monument to the power of perfection. <laughs> I love her talking about it. We're safe here, right? No monsters can enter. Not even a kitten. We're safe. Really? We can't stay here forever. Just because we're prey doesn't mean we need to be helpless. Hmm. Isn't like it I when love people mess with animals. 
Oh, he's not looking. He's already starting to look pale. So, this is your mom's place? Wonder if she's around. Be right down. She's going to the potty. <laughs> nice. What a gift. <laughs> I love them. We needed a safe place, and your mom had one waiting. A temple is a temple. Maybe you could say hi to your dad while we're here. No thanks. What could it hurt? <clears throat> I don't want anything from him. He's had his chances. Honestly, you've done more for me in the past few days than my father's done in my entire life. If I have to stick with someone... Careful. I think you're about to call me your friend. I love them so much. But you know... <gasps> Singer things were poisonous. Oh no. <laughs> oh. <laughs> don't mind us. Maybe it has to be ocean water. Oh, I don't think or it's working. Not. Oh no. He's oh, he does not look good. <gasps> oh, baby boy. Don't like the sound of that. She is just casually strolling along. I hate it. Terrifying. We're gonna get to the altar, and I'm going to ask my mom for help. I thought we don't ask for help. Well, now we have to. You're literally poisoned, babe. I don't like this. I don't like this. Guys, did, did you hear that? Hear what? What are you hearing? Babe, what are you hearing? So much is happening. Don't mind us carrying a deathly ill poisoned boy up to the top of the St. Louis Arch. She spoke to you. Elector did that with me back in the museum in New York. What did she say? What did she say? What happened? Ooh. Ooh! Oh, the shadow! Ooh! Girl, what is happening? Annabeth. I think that was a chimera. How did the chimera even get inside here? How did any monster get inside here? Annabeth. We're in a sanctuary. Athena would have had to let her in, but why would she do that? Annabeth! Girl, tell us what's happening. She said my impertinence wounded my mother's pride. And that <gasps> that will be my doom. Impertinence? What kind of... Deuce's head. I signed the note. And I went along with it. It embarrassed her. Now she's angry. She said, oh, Medusa's head, now I don't care if my kid dies? Yeah, this is not good. This is not good. They'll be up here any minute, and if my mother isn't going to protect us, then we'll just have to fight it out up here. Oh, there's so many people. There's too many people? So many people. Yeah, y'all gotta go. Everyone, you and Percy, out. follow them down. No, no, we're, we're not splitting up. Go over it, come on. No. <clears throat> no, 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 we're all getting out of here together. We won't make it. The Chimera is the demigod killer. Someone has to stay back to slow her down. I don't like that title. Help him down the stairs and get him to the river. And don't stop. Not till you get to Hades. Not till you- Annabeth! Wait. Take this. Shut up! Shut up! I would have never made it to Hades. Percy? Percy, please! But you can. Oh, he already loves them. Oh, I already love them. You don't understand. I am such a hardcore, die-hard Persimeth stan. This is, this is starting something in me. Don't fight it. You'll just make her angry. She looks so cool, but this is terrifying. Oh my god. Oh, Percy. Oh! Oh! That just... the impact. Oh. I just need... Boom, hold 
now there's a hole? All right. Time to jump, Percy. Oh no. <gasps> are we gonna get a hand or are we just gonna see him falling? Oh, we're getting a hand. Is there a so river below you? I can't even see. You had a chance, did you? Only someone cared enough for you to provide you with one. <gasps> oh. Not the silence. Not the silence. My hands are so clammy. You. Oh, that water said, I'm saving you. <gasps> oh, what's holding him? What's holding him? Can he breathe? <gasps> you are frightened. A Nereid. It's okay. all right, Percy. Your father sent me to tell you it's all right just breathe just breathe he's always been here oh it's so hard for him to stand back to see you struggle it is so hard for us all oh they all love him and he's so very proud oh oh it hurts even more for annabeth I mean, in a way, Poseidon claiming him is him saying that he loves him because he did not have to claim him. <gasps> oh, look at that. Oh, she's gorgeous. I love the Nereid. She's beautiful. That's it? You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I can't believe that that is where we're ending. As a hardcore Persebeth stan, I can't explain the things that this show is going to do to me, okay? I, like, I am already seeing, like, the little glimpses, and this is, like, just the beginning of it. I love it so much. It's so good. Oh, my God. That was so intense. That was so short. That was so short. He's not even out of the water. We ended, he was still underwater. And oh my God, <sighs> Percy talking about how you shouldn't have to earn your parents' love and like n seeing like that not only does he have the unconditional love from Sally that he's had his whole life, but like having the Nereid tell him that his dad is so proud of him and he hates having to like not like help him like he hates having to hold back that like his dad loves him so much too like just hearing that hearing that like confirmation it makes me so much more sad for Annabeth who literally was just told like actually your mom is letting you get your shit rocked your mom is basically telling you you embarrassed me you can die and meanwhile Poseidon's like nope grabbing my son out of the sky saving his life like, oh, it's so, it's, there's so many layers. It's so complex. It's so deep and detailed and I love it so much. It's so good. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and watching season one, episode four of Percy Jackson with me. Oh my God, y'all, I'm not ready for everything else this season is gonna bring. I am so not ready, but I need it all immediately. So if you wanna join me on this journey, of watching all of these episodes together. You can like the video, you can subscribe down below, join me as I continue watching Percy Jackson and uh, I continue to freak out and lose my mind every single episode. In the description, I will leave all of the previous episodes, one, two, and three, uh, will all be linked in the description. If you have not seen them, go back, check them out. Uh, it's a lot more of me freaking out and uh, having a fun time. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I had a good time. I hope you guys had a good time. And I will see you very soon for another episode of Percy Jackson and the Olympians.